Okay, so we've been rolling around the country a little bit, and we're having to use field expedient methods here since we could only find a, uh, a uh, black and white printer in this region. So, yeah, if you don't know why this needs burning or why I really didn't even feel like bothering to finish it and coloring it in once I found that, um, then you haven't been following. But right on cue, below this, we have a second flag that also needs to go. This flag oversaw one of the greatest genocides in the history of North America. Uh, between the, the gold rush and really the end of the 1920s, which was just a, a, a genocide of native people, uh, the, the flag of the California Republic. Um, and, you know, the state of California actually took taxpayers' dollars and uh, paid uh, the expenses of the people that were committing the genocide, actually going out with guns and killing other human beings into the 20th century. So these are two flags that just have to go, and we're going to make them go now. So, goodbye California Republic flag, goodbye stars and bars. Oh, maybe I should add while we're here, there's another really good reason to get rid of the California Republic flag that people may not know about. That animal on there is the grizzly bear, and we forced it into extinction in this state. So, all right, John Sims, you rock. Let's make fire. Goodbye, Confederate flag. Goodbye, California Republic flag. Happy Fourth of July, everybody.